Before we get started, I just want to say this is B-Boy Tech and you're watching the B-Boy Tech Report channel and this is an episode of B-Boy Tech Modular Journal. Subscribe, like, share, and I'll keep bringing more dope content to you. By the way, stop at bpeople.com and pick up the latest sample packs, t-shirts, and fly stuff. Alright, let's go. So what I'm bringing to you now is a really dope module that I just want to give my first impressions on. Um, and as I get to know it more, I'll probably circle back around and do more videos on it. But here's the thing. You know that I do mod bap. Uh, mod bap is modular synthesis and hip hop boom bap production styles. And so I'm always enamored by anything that kind of harkens back to DJ technology. And my man Ralph over at Emblematic Systems uh, put together this really dope module. I, I don't even know why anybody has done it before, but I just want to turn you on to it because if you're watching this channel, then you're probably into the mod bap movement and into modular synthesis to say the least, uh, and beat making. So with this module, it's, uh, it's called the Catalyst Flow. Now there's two types of modules, two of these Catalyst modules. One is the Catalyst, and that has, I don't know, maybe just a run-of-the-mill basic fader in it. I, I won't say run-of-the-mill, it's probably just a basic fader. But uh, the Catalyst Flow has a premium Inno fader in it. And if you know DJ equipment or you are a DJ, you already know what the Inno fader is. So the Catalyst Flow has the Inno fader in it. This, uh, there's an expansion module, and I, I don't know exactly what the expansion module gives you, but it's a to-you thing, and, and it gives, it expands on the module. But here's the deal. The catalyst flow is set up like this. There's eight voltage outputs. Every output has a knob associated with it, so there's eight knobs. Imagine a situation where you're basically using it like you uh, call up a preset. So if I'm doing a set and I have these voltages set to modulate, say, plunk, let's explain the, the as a matter of fact, let's explain the passion I have going on here. Here's what I'm doing. I'm using the catalyst flow, plunk, tip top echoes, or tip top audio echoes, and I'm using Dave Rossum's evolution filter. So I'm using the eight outputs of the catalyst flow. I'm sending voltage to X and Y and decay on IntelliJ Plunk. I'm sending three voltages to uh, the CVable parameters on Tip Top Audio's Echoes. The fidelity portion is really important to me because it actually adds a bit of lo-fi. Since I'm doing mod bap, I want that lo-fi fill-in. So I'm actually sending a voltage to the fidelity. And you can kind of hear pops hiss a little bit of crackle uh, between the, the things that I'm modulating there. And the last thing is I'm sending a couple of voltages to uh, the evolution filter, the filter cutoff, and the genus, which is the amount of poles on the filter. So that's what the patch is, and let's listen to it.
So yeah, that is the Catalyst Flow. This is B-Boy Tech. Thanks for stopping by. Please do subscribe, like, and share, and I'll see you next time. Peace.